Hello everyone and welcome to Born Losers Gaming. No black screen this time, we're kicking things off right away. We're here to play They Bleed Pixels. It's the second game I've announced for my No Lives November, and <laughs> funny enough, this almost didn't happen, but I'll get into that later. So let's go ahead and get the game started. So, I, I'm not gonna show you, uh, no. I'm not gonna show you the, the, the first scene, but pretty much it's just like, oh, lady goes to a trouble school for troubled people, uh, it's real spooky because everything's dark and I don't know why she got dropped off at night. But then there's a guy and he has a double prong blade, which is kind of weird. Who has? Oh, and then he cuts himself. That's odd. Oh, and it bleeds onto a book and then there's the blood book and that's the story. More story. Got a little lady. She's in the library there. Oh, blood. That's creepy. You're supposed to return books, you know, without blood. Come on, guys. Oh, no. That's it. She dies. The end. <laughs> okay, maybe not. You'll see soon enough that dying doesn't really matter in this game. Go figure. Oh, oh, so she, deci she decides to pick up and read. The okay. No, that's normal. That always happens when I read a book. Doesn't that happen when to you guys? Oh, Howard Phillips Lovecraft. My visions faded and I saw again the only evil moonlight. The brooding desert? Oh, no, I didn't finish reading that. Okay, well, <laughs> here's a prologue. Okay, there's a little tutorial here. Tap A to jump. So, yeah, just tap it. If you hold it down, you'll, well, you'll get hurt. Hold A to jump and you can double jump. That's good. If that, well, why am I reading you guys the controls? You guys aren't even playing. <laughs> I mean, unless you guys are playing. In which case, cool. That's this cool. I, I I think that used to be a thing a lot more with Let's Plays than it is now. Wait! Stand still to create a safe signal. Well, guess what? I don't play by your rules. I don't stop for nothing. Do you know who I am? I mean, because I don't, and I would love to know who I am. Somebody please tell me who the heck I am. Oh, there's a lot of blood everywhere. That's great. Yeah, if you're easily squeamish, um, well, if you're easily squeamish, I don't know why you would play a game called They Bleed Pixels. That seems like something you probably shouldn't do. Personally. Oh, bomb. That guy. Oh, okay. <laughs> so, as you guys can kind of see, I'm kind of just like blazing through the game. I'm not. I haven't even saved yet. So if I die at any point, that's gonna be bad. Um. I guess, let me give a little bit of background on this game, now that I've, the, get out of here. <laughs> I don't want any of your shit. Okay, I should probably save soon, because, yeah, I mean, there's really no reason not to save, it's just, yeah, okay, okay, let's collect my thoughts. How the game works. <laughs> um, well, you're this girl, and you read a book, and now you're this girl with giant crab claws. Big meaty claws. That was my Mr. Krabs impression. Did you like it? I did. Oh, there are these little pages things. Um, so the point of the game is to get to the end of the level and, well, survive. You have three little hearts in the top right-hand corner. And unlike Legend of Zelda, those may actually be your three hearts. Because really, I am I think anything goes with a game like this. I won't doubt anything. You don't get any life power-ups. You can't regain your HP unless you die. So, <laughs> uh, be careful. Don't, don't mess anything up. Now, the other part of this game is that there are those little paper things, and there's six of them on each level, and you can collect them. They do things. I, oh, goody. The first saw blade to the face of the game. That's great. I think it's even better that it's only the first. It is going to keep on happening. Isn't that good, guys? Isn't that just splend? Oh, God. Okay. Isn't that just splend? diddly -tastic. Okay. This game is a very, very, very hard retro platformer. Hard, challenging, difficult. And you may not be able to see in now with how I'm playing because, I mean, I know the first few levels, but no, it gets so, so incredibly difficult. Like, I... I mentioned earlier, I almost did not play this game because of how, like, oh, I may have made a mistake. I may have, okay, no, I didn't, okay. 
Oh god, it's a stressful game. It's a very, very stressful game because of just how difficult uh, and slippery the controls are. I don't know why they made a game like this slippery. This game really calls for Mega Man like uh, Mega Man like controls, where it's very crisp. You turn when you turn, you run, you jump, jump and shoot, all the good stuff. But in this no, they decided to go with a uh, very, very slippery, bloody game. Well, I mean, bloody doesn't have anything to do with it. Mega Man could have been bloody if it felt like it, but he didn't. So that's probably an okay. Okay. Oh, okay. I was kind of wrong. There isn't no way to get your health back. If you put down one of your save sigils, 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 if you guys know how to pronounce that, uh, you're welcome to tell me because I don't. Oh, here, watch this. Nope. Okay, don't watch this. <laughs> I changed my mind. Bombs generally can't hurt you. They're, um, they'll hurt you if, oh, if and only... Oh, yeah, it goes into slow motion if you kick somebody in the air, but I wanted to do this. Look how cool that is! Look how much blood there is! Isn't that just great? Eat it! Eat the... Okay, no, don't don't actually eat the blood. <laughs> That'd be gross. I mean, I don't know what your guys, uh... What your diet is, but I'm gonna assume blood is not on the... <gasps> oh! Good! No! Oh, that's great! How? Oh, God, it's so sad to look at. Okay, I'm gonna do this right now. Okay, no, I'm not. Turns out I'm a big fat liar. God, I'm so over the place because there's so much about this game to uh, just to talk about and you know go over all the rules, how everything works. Oh, I'm at, and you can see um, wherever you died. You can see your dead body. Isn't that great? There's there's only there are only two buttons. Wow, it's gonna be a great first episode. Do I have have I made a joke yet? No, I haven't. Knock knock. Actually, I can't make that joke anymore because <laughs> I made the joke where I said knock knock on one of my old episodes, and somebody actually responded with "Who's there?" And I was like, "Wait, I don't have a joke." Shoot. No. No. Okay, yeah, I didn't get hurt. <laughs> and so I I had to s swiftly come up with something witty to send him. So I sent him this picture. Throwing it up on screen. <laughs> oh, that's a suave banana. Oh, because I yeah, I was like knock knock. He was like, who's there? I was like, oh, banana. And he was like, ah, yeah, right. And I was like, no, really. Banana at your door, and he wants to know if you're home. I don't know if he was home, but. <laughs> oh, great! I just barely slid onto that spike and got impaled. Great. That's what I wanted to do on a Tuesday afternoon. It's not actually Tuesday. Thursday. If the if you were curious, it is a Thursday right now. <laughs> but I'm almost positive none of you guys are curious about what day. I almost did the exact same thing. <laughs> I'm not doing that again. Let's put on a safe soldier here because I know the part after this is a little wonky. Oh great, nope. God. Yeah, those blue stuff, it's slippery, so you can't control yourself as well. It's all slippery and slick, and if you thought you were slick before, well, check this shit out. Oh, it's a book! Oh, it's the end of the level. Oh, that's good. Let me just sit on my throne of blood. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> that's what I, again, that's what I want to do on my Tuesday afternoon. Oh, hello, creep. Ah. Oh, jeez, I was scared too. Oh, gr lady, girl, you gotta get your finger paint? Got a bit on your hands. You may want to clean that off. You aren't supposed to get fingernail paint on your nails. Oh, more story. Oh, good, blood. Someone needs to patch up whatever on that blood is, whatever, on that, whatever in that book is bleeding. Like, put a bandaid on that shit. Jeez. Okay, we're burying it along with a maple leaf, for reasons untold. Oh, it's a pretty sunset. Oh, it's a spooky midnight. Hello, book. What are you doing on my screen? Girl, you're not supposed to read it again. Girl. God. Oh, jeez. And she has a creepy smile on her face. It's a very gothic, um, designed game, if you, I mean, you could probably already tell, but it's, the, the tones seem very gothic, the, the lady is, oh, hello, blob, guess what, bleed, ha <laughs> excuse me as I dance in your blood, <laughs> oh my god, it actually looks like I'm fucking dancing, <laughs> okay, that's enough of that, kick, 
You didn't mind uh, dying today, did you? I sure hope not. Hold on, I'm gonna kick the guy into the saw blade. Yeah. Luckily, it's not happening. If you get hit by the saw blade, if you get hit by the saw blade, you just fucking uh, well, you just kind of get bounced back. Okay. 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 I can do this, and I won't die. Yeah. Yeah. No. Guys, I may have lied to you. <laughs> I may have lied to you about dying. Uh, I haven't really, I haven't talked about it much, but this, this game is going to be frustratingly difficult. Like, this is one of the most frustrating games I have ever played, and I almost did play it due to how frustrating it was, because I thought, oh, the commentary is going to be awful. And really, it will be, eventually, when I get to a later portion of the game. It's going to just... Shit, okay, well... Yeah, and the, the some of the mechanics in this game are the reason why it's going to be so frustrating, because sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't! Just kind of takes its pick, you know? Like, it's at an ice cream shop, and it's wondering what flavor it wants. It's just like, do I want the functioning flavor, or do I want the half-functioning flavor? Or the not-functioning flavor at all! The functioning flavor is vanilla, and the non-functioning flavor is banana, because artificial banana flavoring is gross. And if you think otherwise, you are incorrect. Oh, let's get that freaking book, page, whatever it is. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it does. To be honest, I... Ow! Ow! No! Oh, I got... I'm all the way back here! And I've died again. Great, there's a little pile of dead me's there. That's good. Shit. <laughs> I have to try and laugh off everything that's going to happen in this game because let me tell you a little bit about myself i'm not an easily irritable person i'm actually fairly i'd like to say i'm fairly level fairly level headed most of the time but this game brings out the worst in me it's incredible how what this game does to me as a person it's Okay, yeah. You can kind of save yourself if you jump at just the right time. It's difficult, but it's possible. Get out of here! I don't want the saw blade to hit me. Shit, shit, fuck. That's no, it's good. I'm also gonna curse a lot in this in this uh, let's play. Uh, maybe. I should... <laughs> oh, oh, oh. oh, I wonder how many parts I'm gonna title let's play. Fuck, because it's probably gonna be a good amount. Oh, good. Lag. That's what I needed. In my in my platformer. Okay, good. You're back. I'm glad you're back. Well, actually, I don't know how. Uh, are you gonna? Yeah, you can't really attack them when they're right there on the edge. Oh, good. That guy just kind of like let himself get skewered. Well, I guess it's not really skewered by the saw blade. Uh, it's just kind of well killed. Shit, shit. No. Saw blades are not really suited for you know ladies of my sort. I know I'm I know I'm apparently mischievous as I'm in the school for mischievous people. I guess it's girls only, which is kinda creepy. What kind of school is that? Like why is it mischievous women? Why isn't this mischievous all? Isn't that like I don't know. That oh did you like just like run into the spikes or something? Cause that blood up there was not there before, I don't think. Cause I didn't do anything to put that there. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever floats to your boat, AI, if you want to kill yourself, that's great. I guess it saves me the trouble of doing it. But um, at the same time, you know, you deserve better. You shouldn't want to do that. You're worth thump something. You're worth... Oh. I just kind of melted there. <laughs> uh, what happens to you when you run into spikes? Oh, you know, I just kind of melt. <laughs> I am... I actually do not exist anymore. But no... Back to the motivational bad guy, I mean, you're worth something. You are you are worth me being impaled on the spike claws that are my hands. The you're you are worth that. And with that motivational speech I just gave to the bad guy, I will see you guys next time in Let's Play Uh Shit, what's the name of the game again? Oh, it's They Bleed Pixels, that's right. How could I forget?